Hi guys, welcome back to Rock Review. Today we're gonna talk about this one bag I got from eBay. Yeah, it's my first um, secondhand luxury bag that I purchased. So let's get started. If you guys like unboxing what's in my bag, stay tuned. And for all new subscriber, welcome. And for my returning subscriber, hello. So here it is. It's my Epi Speedy 25 from Louis Vuitton in red. Here in this scene, I'm showing you the flaws of the bag. There's just few, but this bag just looks amazing for its age. It is a 28-year-old bag, and it looks amazing. Here it's showing it's made from France. She's so pretty, you guys. And here it has this logo and that side and on that side too so it doesn't matter which side you carry so here i'm showing you the pocket it came with i didn't realize it came with a pocket on the side there is no feet on the bottom but that's okay because the leather looks like you can just wipe it off if it gets lightly dirty here i'm showing you the discoloration there's like some orange changing i don't know if you could see and then like a little black um, spots on the sides of the bag but again the color of the bag kind of just camouflaged the whole thing and just how it's made in the material so it's so pretty to me again this is my very first um, secondhand purchase I never looked into it because I just I don't know why but <laughs> I was so happy so I might do it again and I've been always purchasing like the original price, so I kind of slowly, gradually learning because some of the Louis Vuitton bags that are made now is not as great as it was made before. So that made me look into vintage bags, which I love what I got today. And so hopefully in the future, I would be able to buy more and showcase it to you guys and here I'm just showing you guys how it looks inside and there's the product code and this one is made in France in April 1995 and here you can put your key on and this is the fabric how it looks inside 20 years ago so it's very pretty somehow it has a pink to it because of the dye probably or the color of the leather the epi leather so pretty so i'm gonna stuff for next i also bought two items from the ebay this is from a japanese reseller i i bought it at the same person i am not gonna link their um store yet because again i have only bought this for the first time so i don't want you guys coming at me saying hey you know so this is just all risk finding out um which one is great so here i'm stuffing the bag with my nolita 15 my two wallets from louis vuitton my long champ my heart wristlet from coach from last year which is super cute i think they had one this year and then my one dollar tech for my headset it's so cute and I, this one's missing a lock which is fine because I already have three that on I don't even use again here I'm still trying to emphasize that little scratch there or discoloration and, and here I have a little twilly scarf from coach and this I made it shows silver but the gold on this Louis Vuitton is light enough it doesn't even matter but I could always switch it up if I really you know need to but I'm leaving it. And here I'm showing you the scratch on this breast. Near to the handle. Which I'm not liking. But what you're going to do. It's 28 year old. And I did forget to mention. It, I bought this for $391 plus tax. I'll try to put the vi uh, picture up top. If I find um, the pricing. But here I'm trying to do one of those Instagram tying this twilly anyway um if you guys also 
follow vintage sack she has the same bag in blue last year i believe and this is what got me looking into japanese reseller in ebay go watch her she's awesome i'll link her video down below thanks for watching and hope you all have a great day don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my other videos and playlists bye